So today's video is all about makeup and glasses. I'll be showing you how to pair a couple of frames with different makeup looks. And if you're wondering, I do wear glasses, but I'm wearing them only when I'm in front of the computer or when I'm reading or when I'm watching TV. You know, I'm not wearing them all the time, but I know how important it is to to like your frames and to feel comfortable and confident wearing them. So many of you guys requested me to do this video and I was planning on filming it but I had just one pair of glasses and it was kind of old. I had it for a couple of years now so I was planning on purchasing a new one and after that I would film this video. Then glassesusa.com contacted me and they said that they would like to sponsor one of my videos. They provided me with six pairs of glasses, four eyeglasses and two sunglasses and now instead of just showing you one and look, I'll be showing you whole six. Yeah, you can go and check their website, glassesusa.com. They offer a really wide variety of glasses, and the prices start at $48. And this is for both frames and lenses. They also have that really cool feature on their website where you can upload your photo and see how every style looks on you. And remember that once you receive the glasses and you actually try them on yourself and you don't like how they look on you, you can always return them for free and get your money back. They also offer free shipping and one year warranty for their products so go check them out glassesusa.com and now let's go ahead and do some makeup <laughs> So first I'm starting off with this pair called Emilia and it's actually a very elegant one. I also want to mention that you can order all of the glasses that I'll be showing you today with prescription. So for this look I'll keep the eyes quite neutral. First I will apply some warm brown eyeshadow in my crease and then I'll switch to a clean blending brush just to make sure that everything is nice and blended. And then to give some brightness to the look, I'm applying this um, rose gold metallic shade all over my eyelid. I'll also add some of that warm brown shade under my lower lash line. Then I'll go ahead and curl my lashes and then I'll coat them with some mascara. I'm going to skip the winged eyeliner and the false lashes for this look because I really want to keep it um, very natural and simple. Also, the glasses that I'll be wearing have that cat eye shape and that's a perfect opportunity to skip the winged eyeliner. I thought that it was a great idea to match the dusty rose colors on the frames with some dusty rose lipstick. The next pair is called Piero and it comes in a few different colors but I have mine in clear because I think that it's really cool. I decided to pair these glasses with a little bit of a bolder look. I'll start off by applying some brown eyeshadow all over my eyelid. And then using a clean blending brush I'll make sure that the eyeshadow is blended into the crease and there are no harsh lines. And you want to make sure that you apply some of that brown eyeshadow along your lower lashes as well. Here is my favorite part. I'm adding some glitter all over my eyelid. You guys know that I love glitter. And I think that it really makes the look a lot more fun. It's still kind of wearable, but it has that sparkle and shine going on on the eyelid. I think that it's really pretty. And then I'll go ahead and apply some winged eyeliner and I'll also add some false lashes. Don't be afraid to wear false lashes while you're wearing glasses. And if you feel that the falsies are actually touching your glasses, make sure that you go for a shorter pair of lashes. Another trick that you can do is you can curl your own lashes together with the falsies so that you make sure that they point up and not straight towards the glasses. I decided to go with a little bit bolder lipstick on the eyes. On the eyes, what? <laughs> On the leaves.
The next style is called Muse and I think that it's perfect for those of you who are feeling daring and bold. You can find these frames in many other colors on their website, they're not just coming in pink but I think that pink is so cute. And since the frames are thicker and bolder, I decided to keep the eye makeup a little bit more natural. So I'll start off by applying a matte medium brown shade in my crease. And then I'll apply some winged eyeliner and I'll also glue on some false lashes. And then I'm taking again that medium brown shade that I used in my crease and I will apply it along my lower lashes just to add some definition there. I don't usually coat my lower lashes with mascara but I think that when you're wearing glasses it looks really nice if you have a little bit more defined lower lash line. Alright, and onto the fun part now, I'll be wearing a really pretty hot pink lipstick. I wanted to match my lips with the glasses and I think that this look turned out super gorgeous. And do you realize how many shades of pink we have going on at this moment? I think that those of you who love pink will really enjoy the next scenes. <laughs> The next style is called Florence and what I love about it is that it's not the usual pair of eyeglasses. The glass is actually so big that you can actually see what's going on behind it which is great if you want to show off your makeup and still have your glasses on. I decided to wear them with a little bit more dramatic look so I'm starting off by applying a really nice dark grey shade all over my eyelid. After that, I'm taking an eyeshadow that matches my skin tone on a fluffy brush and I'll use it to blend out all the edges of that grey shade into the crease. And then I'm switching to a bigger clean blending brush and I just keep on blending. You really want to take your time with this as you want it all to be nice and seamless, you don't want to have any harsh lines or anything like that. So just take your time, blend, blend, blend and that's the key, just keep on blending. <laughs> Using an angled brush, I will apply some of that grey shade along my lower lashes and I'll also connect it with the other eyeshadows on the upper lid. Next, it's time for winged eyeliner and after that, I'll also glue on some false lashes. I'm applying some black pencil in the outer half of my waterline and then I'm highlighting my brow bone and the inner corners of my eyes with some highlighter just to add some brightness because the eyes are pretty dark at this point. On the lips, I'm going with a really pretty chocolate brown matte lipstick. Lastly, I'll show you my two most favorite pairs of sunglasses from their website. The first one are these floral cat eye frames. I think that they will be perfect for the summer. I decided to pair them with a nude peachy matte lipstick. But not least are these really glamorous sunglasses with a touch of gold at the top. I will pair them with a nude glossy lip. First I will apply some liquid lipstick and then on top of it I will also add the lip gloss. guys enjoyed watching this video and let me know which one was your favorite look i'll have the links to all of the glasses that i wore in this video down in the description box and also if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already you can also follow me on my instagram facebook twitter and also visit my blog all of the links again down in the description box thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye